That starts with Maryland at home on Saturday. Could Iowa put up the points and look as good as they wanted to for those naysayers? No Jordan Kanziri in this game, no problem. Here's LaShawn Daniels. He missed the last two games, but he's back in with a first down there in the red zone to the Maryland Five, and a couple plays later, more from Daniels. 60 rushing yards on the day, and this touchdown to seven nothing Hawkeyes early on. Late in the first quarter, same score, C.J. Bethard to George Kittle. And George Kittle is about to earn the award for outstanding achievement in the field of excellence. Look at the one-handed grab. Beautifully done from Mr. Kittle. Under nine to go in the second, Akram Wadley in the game. I mean, this is the third running back option at the beginning of the season. Look at him plow through. He had 67 rushing yards on the day as well. It's 14 zip Iowa. Just over a minute to go, same score. Maryland punting, it's not very well. It gets blocked and the Hawkeyes are getting the ball back with great field position, which would eventually lead four plays later to Derek Mitchell Jr. from two yards out. He's two yards in. 21 nothing Hawkeyes. Gave up a touchdown and added a field goal. It's 24-7 in the fourth. Perry Hills, watch out for Desmond King. I mean, watch out for Desmond King. We're talking seven interceptions on the season already. This one returned 88 yards for the score. And Iowa wins. Four turnovers for Maryland, the key to this game. Can't overcome that, and they didn't. 31 to 15 is your final. The Terps have now lost five straight games, while the Hawkeyes have won eight straight. They are eight and zero oh for only the second time ever. And they talked to Allison Hayes afterwards. All right, coach, you guys improved to eight and zero. Oh. What was the difference in this game? You walk out of here with another win. Uh, our guys played hard. You know, we didn't. Uh, second half wasn't the prettiest thing, but we played hard and got the job done. And that's all you can ask for. Turnovers were key for you in this game, and Desmond King does it again. Yeah, we were hoping to make that an edge, and uh, Desmond did a great job, obviously, turning that into a big play. They answered right back. So we have some things we have to clean up, but we're just really pleased to get our win today. Just reading my keys, watching the receiver go back in. I seen him do the screen. I just met him at the receiving point. Seen the quarterback let it go, and then it was just off from the races from there. This defense has been so tough this season, and, and how have you been able to have so much success against teams and then again against Maryland today? Um, just playing together. That's all it takes is read your keys, playing together, play as a family out there. Can't be selfish out there. Everybody plays as a team, communicating back in and everything to take care of itself.